people will be doing everything they can right to beat the heat this holiday weekend. But what about our most vulnerable populations? Yeah, that's right. TBS 13's Tori Apodaca joining us live now from Land Park with how some are staying safe and staying cool, Tori. Definitely the hottest day we've seen so far this year. I know out here today we can really feel that. Right now, though, I am covered by all these nice trees in the shade, so not feeling quite as hot as I might have been while I was in the sun. Now, some of the older folks we spoke with today say that they're going to be sticking in the AC, but other people will be hitting the river. The heat is back in Northern California, and though you may be tempted to jump into the river, the rivers can make even an Olympian swimmer uh, challenged. That's because of rushing waters, unknown debris underneath, plus the sheer shock your body will go into thanks to the snow melt. You've got less than 30 minutes before you start seeing significant signs of hypothermia. Teeth chattering, tingling hands. Metro Fire says go in with a plan and a life jacket. I think we're going to be able to beat this heat. Jerry Hamilton plans on sticking in the AC with her mom at a senior care center this weekend. They were checking each unit to make sure that everything's working. She says her air conditioner was fixed earlier this week, just in time for the heat. It's kind of scary when it's hot in here and or we don't have air. And for those on the streets that don't have AC, Sacramento County's also got an option, cooling centers. Regional Transit has actually offered free rides to people that are going to the respite centers, regardless of where they are in the county. The county is meeting homeless folks where they are at four days a week with water bottles and connecting them to 211. We specifically opened our motel voucher respite program for people that are elderly and homeless. Whether being outdoors or cranking up the AC, the best way experts say to stay safe in the heat, hydrate. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. I know I have been carrying around my water all day. This one's not open yet, but I'll be getting to that shortly, staying hydrated as I'm out in these conditions. And Sacramento County will have a list of all of those cooling centers you just heard about on our website. And also coming up at 6, we'll have more on how you can protect yourself against heat-related illnesses. Yeah, and good idea to keep that water handy mm -hmm. for sure. Thank you, Tori.